still Black History Month, but you know. We gonna have us a burning service. I mean a burning service. How long y'all think it's gonna be before they go back to burning crosses on people's lawns? A pastor of a church decides to hold a book burning service. And some people don't think that Black History Month is important while they're burning books about black history. Okay. I wanna remind you that it is still Black History Month, but you know. We gonna have us a burning service. Listen, if you can't read, just say you can't read. You don't need to burn a book to to tell me you can't read. If you can't, if you if you have the reading comprehension of a of a sea turtle, just say you have the reading comprehension of a sea turtle. I mean, it's it's not that hard to learn how to read. I was married to somebody whose first language was not English, and he used hooked on phonics to learn English. You know, that still works. His English was, you wouldn't even even thought he, 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 you, he sounded like as if he was born in the United States, not in a, an overseas. But just say you can't, you can't read, write, or comprehend. You know, just say that. It's not, you know, I'm not, I'm not fucking doing, I'm not good at doing long division or, Sometimes statistics, like the fucking, all of that shit. I wasn't good at that. I fucking, I think I barely even passed statistics the second time around. But, I mean, if you're not good at it, just say you're not good at it. You know? I literally, the new math my child was doing years ago. Which was fucking weird to me. I literally sat down when I when I did when I had time off, time to myself, and this was while I was going to school and working at the same time. You know, I literally sat down and learned how to do the math, the new math they were doing. You know, I mean, it's it's not that hard. I'm like. If you don't know how to read and you cannot and you don't have the reading comprehension, just say that. Burning books just tells us <laughs> in so many words that you cannot read and you cannot comprehend. And so you're going to make everybody else suffer because you're mad that black people and indigenous people and brown people exist on this land. Which, by the way, Susan... um. You know, my ancestors were here for hundreds of thousands of years before your people came in 1942 and gave us plagues um, and famine um, and raped and molested our children, you know, and our women. But I digress. But if you just can't read, you just can't read. There's no shame in that. Bye.